everyone welcome to next day today we will create a form where there will be several of tick boxes so this is the form that we are going to create today you can tick over here and we have selected five subject type science math whatever your favorite you can tick over here and it here we have feedback box where you can give feedback about the page or everything whatever you like here you can select your city then you can select any city i have prepared the live and the chennai kolkata and mumbai and here we have a submit button so now let's click it so hello and welcome everyone today we will create a form very very useful for us so for now i have shown you before how the form looks like so let's create it i have made a folder over here this are called folders so i have created a folder that is form for team dot html this is the Follow me up to the corner first. So let's see how it's going to be. So we'll first click on this, and the whole body of HTML will open. So now you can see that HTML, HTML L line means HTML language that we have in the beginning. It means in the beginning language that you have known. So I am English, so I am there English. So that's it. That is necessary. So title will be right. A title over here that is login form. Okay, login form done. So now we have closed the head. Now it's time for body. So it's time for body. Title we have created that is login form. So now we need something like registration form. We we'll write heading. We we'll need heading. So we have to write X. Let's write uh, two heading, and that will be what shall we get? Registration form. Okay. And we have kept a registration form. So done. Now we have to create format. Form the form. So let's write here form Excel. It will help us to create a form. That is slash is Excel dot PHP. Okay. So now we have to create it. After creating it, we will need a placeholder. We are creating a form that has email address or phone number and password. So we need our input over here. We will write our input type and it is equal to Because we have to write the email that is in text, so we will write the text, and then we have to write the folder that is email or phone number. So after that, we need to close it. Sorry. After closing it, to break the line, we have to use the attack. After using the BR tag, we need another place on the for password. So we we'll write input type equals to password, and then again place on the place on the equals to password password. After closing it, sorry, I have found the password. Hey, password. After closing it. We can we again have to be attack to break the line. So I'm using here to break like that. It will be more helpful and it's more space. Now we we are using we are getting a form for the students. We passed class 11 or class 12. We are studying. So for that we have to create like check boxes for them. Tick either they are in class 11 or they are in class 12. So to create the check boxes, we will use heading first at heading first, first heading first and select no. Plus, after closing it, now to after closing it, we have to use level tag. Level four equals to we have to give like ID. ID number okay, one hundred, hundred and one okay. Let's give it hundred and one, and you can see level like hundred close. I am using so the back level, level, and then how much are you using level? Now we have to provide an input also. Input type equals to to create an input box when you read it. There will be type of video and then then we have to give a number also. You might be using class eleven or class twelve. So class eleven and then name equals to class eleven. And then ID. Let's give them ID. So we have to give space equals to one hundred and one. We have to give one hundred and one. Let's close it and then plus nine. Plus nine. 
So after having this, you have to close the new one and then to break the line, you are using the attack, double the attack, and now again for plus two one, you are using the above, double attack, and then input, input type equals to radio, okay, and then value equals to plus two one. Main equals to plus two one and then ID equals to hundred and two. Why again hundred and two? So I'm going to label for ID hundred and two hundred and two and then close after that we have to write plus twelve after returning it we are closing the label and then we are using BR that to close the sorry to break the line. After using it, now our form looks like this. Registration form that is the heading, email, phone number, password, select your class, and then you can select it. See, you can select it. Okay. So let's get after I give you a tag. Now you will write about the subjects that it will be interested. So for that, we will use heading 4 and then close the link, select your field. And the subject. After writing this, so we have to write subjects. For that, we are using a label for math. Label for math subject. We have to close it. So, we need to create the input box. We need to input type is equal to, we have to create checkboxes to pick the subject. So, we need checkbox. And then we have to give value value equals to math because we are creating value of math. After that, name we have to give the name of the subject, name is equal to subject, subject, and then ID, ID that is 101. After that, we have to create it right here math. So we have created for math now. To give a one decline, let's get to the Moses. So again, we will for science. Let's try to subject science. Science. And then close it. Now we need to input box. Input type. Let it check box. Check box. And then value. We need to provide value. Value equals to science. Science and then name that is subject. After that, we need to provide ID. ID equals to 102. So, after we need to upload it and after closing it, we need to write sign. So, after writing up to this much, we need to use the attack. So, we can make 4 5 of this one. So, let's make 4 5. I will copy it. I will copy. And then I will paste it over here. Again, I will paste here. We need 45 subjects. Paste. And paste. So after that, we have user science and here is now let's write physics. Yes, so when as far as yes, physics, that is physics. Physics name ID will be 103. And here physics. To get here to create a beer tag, and let's write our social. Social, then I'm going to change it to social. Social, really, I have met all the subjects like math, science, and then physics, and then social, and then science, and then history. Now we have to make something different. After creating this, now we will see the output how the output. Goals. So we have created a form which looks like this. Uh, here you can enter your email number or phone number, here you can enter your password, here you can enter your class, you can tick over here and here select your subjects. You can select any of them like math, if you like math, you can select math, physics, science, social, under science and history. It's multi selecting type of form that we have created just now. Now let's create for addresses. For city we will have here and some sub button also we will create. So let's see how it goes. Now for the addresses we will create something different and that is first of all heading, that's four and then let's select 
your city. Now you need to select any other city. There will be many cities in India, Kerala, Bangalore, Chennai, Kolkata, Mumbai, wherever you live. So for that we need option tag. Option value equals to Delhi. If you are living in Delhi, you can add Delhi and closing it. Delhi. So similarly, I am creating many of them. Kolkata. Kolkata, sorry, I forgot to do something. Let's see what I can do. I have to give it to a bracket. So, Kolkata. So, similarly, I have created four five names that is Delhi, Kolkata, Mumbai, Chennai, Bangalore, and Hyderabad. Now, we require something different here. Now, we need to set up the sorry, sorry, let's select the city. Mm, we have found something. I found something. Sorry for that. And we need to select, select tag, city that I forgot before. Sorry for that. Mm, closing this game automatically. Select that total break line. We will use two break line tags here. Now, let's see how the form became. Let's see the output till now. So till now the form looks like this. You have to select a city, right? So, so you can select over here. See Delhi, Kolkata, Mumbai, Chennai, Bangalore, and other that select city. You can select any of them, any one of them. So we have used the select tag to select the city. So now let's create more. We have to create some feedback box over here for the feedback and then submit button because we are creating a form and we need a submit button. But before that, I think that you are able to see these things. They are Delhi. Kolkata, Mumbai, and Chennai, but I'm able to see. But when you will perform this, you will be able to see in your system. So, right now, I think you are able to see. So, see here, I will change this number and then see how that came. So, I have at least what you are able to see. Sorry for that. When you will create the form, you will be able to see. So, we have Mumbai, Chennai, Bangalore, and Delhi. So, let's keep it in Delhi. Sorry for that. So, let's create a submit button and feedback box for the form. For, for creating feedback button, we need a tag that is called text area. Text, sorry, text area. Text area name equals to feedback we need to have your feedback because it's feedback box feedback and then we have to provide your id equals to 101 and then because to provide feedback we need a placeholder we need a box box is known as placeholder so we need to write here placeholder that is why we are using feedback box placeholder that is placeholder because to know about the opinion of others or customers so we'll use so write something here like please Give your valuable feedback. Yeah. Right. Thank you. So after writing this, we have to close the text area. That is text area that have automatically closed. That has automatically closed, and then feedback. Feedback. Now we. We will break the line using the break tag and then we need input type. Input type equals to submit. We need a button to submit. So this is for the submit button. Submit the value of the button that is submit. It is the name of the button. So we will do submit. Sorry, it is like submit. No, sorry for that. It's submit and then we will close it and then. The form has already closed, and now we will see the output how it goes. How the output so the horns looks like this. You can see here feedback, but feedback box. It is the feedback box, and this is the submit button. Then nothing cannot get X and PSP yes. because we are using offline. So now this is you can write anything. Thank you for your um, chance to join. Yeah. Thank you. So now you can create it over here and you can extract it also and you can construct contract construct it as well. So this is the submit button now. It seems like white form. It's purely white. Now we'll use your CSS that will help us to change the color of the form. We will use to change the color of the form and we will use body color to change the color of this registration which I've written over here. That is the head. So let's change it out. Not check it out, let's change it out. So for CSS we will use 
see as a fasting body so for body for body background for the background we are using background color equals to blue violet we'll use something like that looks cool blue violet blue violet now after that we'll use css on the firm we'll use css on the head now head for that we'll need style type equals to where we're using text text so let's css after that we have to close it after closing this time we have to close it and then we want to use where we are using heading where is the heading uh, registration form this one that is that's too okay user sorry that's two and then upper curly packet and close curly packet color that color is good good so now let's see the output after using css okay that's it so guys this is the output see over here the body background color we have used that is violet blue violet that is here this is the blue violet and the style css type we have used on color gold gold is over here see on the registration form you can see this is golden color and this is blue violet now you can select a class that is class i'm reading class 12 so i have not here i have picked on class 12 marks and five seven marks things so sir history only this three i don't like this three so um, favorite city select a city so i'm not from india i'm from Australia, but i'm selecting it like bangalore i'm writing feedback and so much thank you so much for watching this video and then i'm submitting it so thank you can i get i guess it's so sad so thank you guys please subscribe to the channel if you get more video you can comment it out on 